Hey Thomas Tubers, how you doing? Thought I'd make another really quick video again today because guess what? The Eternals final trailer has come out. Now, I had to really think for myself for a second because I wasn't sure if I had seen the trailer for The Eternals. And I remember seeing the uh, bits of the trailer for the Marvel Celebrates the Movies trailer where they showed their upcoming roster for the next uh, phase, phase four. But I think I've seen the other trailer. I just don't remember it very well. So I'm really excited to see this final trailer and see what we've got on offer. Hopefully we'll see some new, some new stuff and uh, get a little bit more information about what this overall story is going to be like. However, it is Marvel Phase 4 and they're being very, very tight-lipped about, you know, the stories involved in all the movies and everything like that. So we might just get some nice images and a few little nice quotes from some of the actors and have to put it together for ourselves or wait until we see the movie. But anyway, without further ado, shall we react to the final Marvel Eternals trailer uh, before I, I wet myself with excitement? Let's get into it now. Don't forget to like, share the video, comment down below what you thought of the Eternals trailer, whether you're gonna go see it or not. And let's get into it, kids. Boom. Oh, straight into it. Hey, Salma Hayek. Richard Madden. Game of Thrones fans are so excited. Brought everyone back with a snap of a finger. Okay, so Thanos gets a mention, that's good. Turn of the population. Provided the necessary energy for the emergence to begin. Oh. How long do we have? Seven days. Seven days to what? Seven days. We came here 7,000 years ago. To protect humans from the deviants. Deviant mention, good. Why didn't you guys help fight Thanos? Jon Snow! All the other terrible things throughout history. Yeah, why didn't you help? We were instructed not to interfere in any human conflicts unless deviants are involved. By who? Celestials? We need to find the others. Well, at least now we know why they weren't involved in Thanos or anything else. Angelina. Hello. Hello. This is what the end of the world looks like. At least we have front row seats. You know what's never saved the planet? Your sarcasm. Ah, oh, their ship. We have loved these people since the day we arrived. When you love something, you protect it. Mm. Pretty. So pretty. Come out, Nanjiani! Yes! Who's that? Thought it was Thanos for a minute. I bet you've built the perfect safe house. Well, what's this even made of? Vibranium? Nope. Fall collection. I <laughs> November 5th, happy birthday to me. My birthday's November 1st, so you know what I'm seeing for, for my birthday. <laughs> so that was the trailer for Eternals, the final trailer for Eternals. How awesome did that look? Once again, though, not a lot of information to go on. Um, so the main point of information that I grabbed from that trailer was that uh, the reason the Eternals didn't help out with the Thanos or with anything, basically, over the past three phases of the MCU that required help from a large number of superpowered people is because they were instructed not to unless um, their own bad guys whose name I've just completely forgotten. Unless those spiky looking wolf thingies are involved. 
I'm sorry guys, I don't know the names of them. Uh, I, I'm not too versed in the Eternals world as much as I would like to be, but I'm getting there. I'm, I'm teaching myself, you know, with each new movie that comes out and each new superhero that comes out, if I don't know a lot about them, I, I read up about them and I, and I learn about them as much as I can so I can enjoy it on a bit more of a level that other, you know, comic book fans and the animated series fans can as well. Anyway! Uh, I, I promised myself to stop saying anyway, because I say anyway a lot in these videos. Anyway, anyway, anyway. Anyway. So, uh, yes, November 5th, Eternals. Go see it at the movies, man, because remember what happened with Black Widow and how, um, was it Black Widow? Go see it at the movies, guys, because remember what happened to previous Marvel films, things like Black Widow and everything that have bombed at the office. Bombed at the office? Bombed at the box office. Uh, just because we're not in a position to see them. If you are in a position to see them at the movies, I know it's more expensive than, you know, splitting it between your family and, and watching it on Disney+, Plus, but, you know, come on, this is what it's there for, and it looks fantastic on the big screen. This looks so pretty, so pretty, and I love all the different actors. You've got Game of Thrones alums in there, you've got Kit Harington and Richard Madden, so I can't wait to see those two brothers back at it again. Although, I hear they're competing over Gemma Chan's love in this movie, so that might be awkward for them. Um... Angelina Jolie, of course, Kumail Nanjiani, looking beef as ever, <laughs> as well as many, many others, don't forget Salma Hayek, um, oh, I'm really sorry, I forgot the name of the woman from The Walking Dead, who I love as well, um, and she's in it too, and he's in it, and there's that guy who's also in it, and then there's also that girl, and... The, the other guy in it too. And that's so exciting. I love them all that I can't even remember their names. <laughs> all right. Uh, but anyway, so that was the Eternals trailer. How exciting. I'm so excited for this. Okay, let's do it. Let's do it. Woo. Okay, let's uh, finish off this video and don't forget to uh, like, share, subscribe. If you like, no pressure. I don't give a shit either way. Okay, but watch the video at least and enjoy it. And um, let me know down below in the comment section what you're excited to see about in the Eternals. Uh, remind me what the name of those people who I've missed. I could just rewatch the trailer right now, but then I'm going to go edit it afterwards. So, you know, I've got things to do, people. So let me know about the name that I forgot about the bad guys in the Eternals. Uh, they look like a bit more updated version of the bad guy, the grassy, spiky wolf thing from that shitty M. Night Shyamalan Lady in the Water movie. But I'm sure they'll be better than that movie. So, yeah. Okay, guys, thanks for joining us. We'll see you again for more trailers and more TV shows and movie reactions coming up. And uh, don't forget, A to the folks. Ciao! <laughs>